Hey guys, it's Steph from My Once Upon the Moon. I thought I would do another What's My Father Fox video. Uh, this is my personal aqua chameleon. I absolutely love the chameleon line of Father Foxes, but uh, this one has given me nothing but headaches. Um, I've had some problems with it. I did message Father Fox. They told me to take it to a leather repair shop. Um, I haven't even had this thing for four months yet, so I was... Uh, wasn't terribly impressed with that. So, um, I don't know if you can see, Let's see if I can focus, um, the color fade on the strap. And it's also fading badly around the edges. And as you can see, that little brown spot right there, the color is peeling off. And then I just noticed that spot down there, that little brown spot on the edge. And the color's peeling off there as well. So not very impressed. Um, the strap itself is tearing. I don't know if I can get it in good lighting now. Pro oh, see that little white spot there? Right? Yeah, right at the top. So it's tearing off. But I love the chameleon line. Um, I have to say it's probably my favorite. I have the A5 in red and my husband just bought me the personal in black because that's the only color they have left on the US site and this one is just pissing me off. Pardon my French. Okay, getting into it. Um, what do we have that there? Are six card slots and then the big pocket at the bottom, pen loop with elastic on the back. Um, my pen of choice has been since I was a kid. Uh, and I just recently found them again. The Papermate Flares in Medium. This is black. And I use six other colors all together. Uh, Tim Horton, Starbucks. Some Avery tabs, which I don't use very often. Uh, this post-its I cut down to fit on my monthly sheets for my budgeting. And this is just... I, don't know, I like the size. In the pocket... I have Christmas kettle card and Martha Stewart and post-it notes. Um, this is the top opening envelope. It has a makeshift goal list for 2012 and some blog post sheets. I can't remember the site I got these off of. And then some pages at the back to write my goals and my New Year's resolutions for 2013. And that's my husband and I on our wedding day. Um, I made this pocket. This is from... Avery sells them for the 8.5 by 5.5 notebooks. And it kind of comes like a booklet itself. So it has the right-hand pocket and the left-hand pocket. And they're um, fused together. So I just cut them apart. And I just have... My daughter's physiotherapy referral and this Givenchy uh, perfume sample. Hope you do. Um, these are my Christmas post-it notes. These are post-it note brand. These are knock-knock brand. They were sent to me by somebody in the Philopel project. And I can't remember who it was. Mm, Stacy, maybe? If you sent these to me and you're watching this video, let me know below so I can give you proper credit. And thank you, because they're wonderful. I love Knock Knock products. Um, these are tabs by Arc. And little see-through things. I like them, but they leave a residue on the plastic. So I just put them on this um, hotless sheet by Daytimer. These are more flags. I found these actually at the dollar store. My local dollar store, Dollarama. Uh, there's ten different colors. And um, I haven't used them too much yet. That's what the back looks like. Um, these are my happy stickers, happy face stickers for rewards, heart stickers. Uh, Tracy sent me these. These are so cool. Um, they're little arrows. I think she said she got them at a dollar store uh, where she lives. And I think they're fan. Wow. My iPhone's going, going a little bit weird. Uh, they're fantastic. I love them. And she sent me those ones too. What is going on with my iPhone? Hmm. I'm going to have to get myself a new camera. These are more knock-knock. Wow. 
I don't know what's going on here. These are more knock knock uh, post it tabs or post it notes. Um, I like them. I like paperwork, so anything that I have to fill out is great. Um, this is my first tab. It says info, and really it should say to do because there isn't anything behind here except to do lists that I don't even use. So these are the Filofax ones, and then these are a no name brand that I have no idea. Come on. I have no idea how to figure it out. There's no marks on them, there's no nothing. I don't know where they came from. I got them at Valley Village, in a binder in Valley Village. Um, my next tab has this little sticker. Leaping from one idea to the next. Oh, also in the to-do section I just have some project sheets. Things I gotta do in my in my house. Um, just one of those post-it note things. And I have people, and it has my addresses, phone numbers, and the Philopal Philopal addresses. And if you want to be a part of Philopal, I have a link by blog below so that you can join us. Because it's great fun, and I've made some super friends. Um, monthlies. It's my next time. More knock knock sticky notes. Those things are awesome. Um, little knock knock sticky notes also sent to me by Tracy. I don't want to use them because I don't know where to get more from. They're so cute. Um, Filofax stickers. I really like these. Yes, they're a pain in the arse to get off the plastic, but I really like them. Uh, a little note from Jenna. Jenna's bookshelf, if I remember, I will link that below. She made these for me. These are my monthly sheets. And she made them for me. She has a video on her file of facts as well. And she made all these great forms and sheets. And um, I did a trade with her and she was kind enough to send these to me. So she sent me the rest of this year. And all of next year. Look at those. I think they're just, they're gorgeous. I love them. They're so pretty. Anyway, that's enough of that. My shopping list. And my weekly. Again, these are by Knock Knock. I think they're hilarious. Uh, my husband thought that they were rather rude. I think they're hilarious. They're for Christmas. And they are exclusive to um, Canadian bookstore Indigo. So um, you can probably order them. I think it's chapters.indigo.ca. And they're also by Knock Knock. More file effects stickers. I love them. And Paper Chase stickers. Saz was kind enough to send these to me. I absolutely adore them. Um, I took the backing off of them because I couldn't find the edge of the sticker and I kept pulling the backing off anyway. Oh, and these are sent. These are also little sticky notes. And Lynn sent them to me. So Cloudberry sent them to me. So right now I'm using... Wait, where's my... Look at that nonsense. Um, we've gone two pages. Just regular. I guess my son's birthday is going to be eight. We went all out. Kind of gave him a few stickers. Let's see if I can focus it. There we go. I think he got stickers from everywhere except paper trees. So I'm going to have to give him one of those. Um, these are Glitterazzi stickers. Um, I'm leaving getting my turkey a little late, my to-do list. These are the Daytimer Hot List sheets, and they're just sticky on the side. So I use those right now for my to-dos. And then this little marker up here marks off the Week on Two Pages cotton cream. And they were sent to me by Sam, which is fantastic. So. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm really sorry if this video is going kind of fast. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Um, I have the whole year in here. Oh, I don't. I lied. I'm such a liar. I only have until the beginning of July. I have my notes section. These are... Uh, we're watching my son for some medical issues. My youngest son. These are pros and cons for getting a beagle, things I need in the house, my blog ideas, 
This is a show I love. It's called Brad Meltzer's Decoded. And some of the episodes in his show have, um, like, codes and things. So I made a sheet so I could write, write them down. Boxing bag supplies, stocking stuffer ideas. Look at all those ideas. There's no way that I'll all fit in a stocking. Good luck to me. Somebody's address. Um, I play word games. So this is kind of like Boggle. But you put the word at the top of your page. In this case, I'll take this off. In this case, I'm doing Merry Christmas. And then in the words Merry Christmas, you use all the letters to make different words. So I have a little game going with my mom and my son. And then this one is going with my other son. And I just have some colored paper. Um, the contemporary paper is my favorite. I really love those colors, but they were getting, they were actually starting to give me a headache. So I'm using some of the other colors. I don't like white paper. It's boring. Um, this page marker down here, after I say I don't like white paper. This is the cotton cream blank paper. And I ordered this after seeing Emmy's Emmy's World. I think I don't know if she did an unboxing or a reveal of her uh, Austerly, Austerly, whatever. That's uh, so why I bought some because I really liked it. This is my stuff tab. Behind it, we're gonna quickly go to the first page. It's a weightless tracker. We're not gonna show that. Some meeting notes. I'm a part of a couple of committees, some Cornell notes. These ones are from printableplanners.net. I have really bad luck printing front and back, but these ones and the meeting notes, I think the meeting notes are from craftleftovers.com, something like that. Um, they're set up to print, so you print off the one sheet and it has like all those little marks all the way around it and it's in the center of the page. So you flip the page around and you print it again. Yeah, it's foolproof. Anything that's not like that, I have no luck. And then another page or project map sheet. And then these were also from um, Jenna from Jenna's Bookshelf. And they are recipe and ingredient sheets. So these two have two boxes per page. And then this one has three boxes per page. And I really like them. Um, she sent me five of those, but I only have two in the binder at the moment. This is another one of the Avery pockets that I cut down to fit. Actually, this is the first one I cut down. And I cut the corner off a little bit so it didn't get stuck in the ring. Um, this is just a, I don't know, some random sticky note pad from someplace. Um, this is one of the multi-purpose pocket holder thingamahoos. I have no idea what it's probably called. Uh, in the business card size, it has some airmail stickers, some speech bubbles. I think there's an address sticker or two back there. A uh, Christmas baking list and... Okay, there's a note. Yep. In the medium sized pocket, there's just some, I don't know if you can see that, some of the labels I use to write my tabs. I got the idea for those from Jasmine Starnino. Starino. From Adventurous JS, I think is her channel. I don't know. And the big pocket at the back, I have some address labels, some reinforcing patches, some more Glitterazzi stickers, and the ever popular Martha Stewart drops. T dot drop, I don't know what they're called. Color coding label thingies. 